Iron Man's powered suit of armor and high-tech weapons help him protect the world. And that is exactly what America's top commando, Admiral William McRaven, wants when his men have to kick down a door. He has got to open that door, not knowing what's on the other side. He's got to be in a position to be protected as soon as that door comes open. McRaven has ordered up the Tactical Assault Light Operator Suit, better known as the Iron Man Suit. The idea? Lightweight armor protection, possibly with battery power flowing through it to give a soldier extraordinary ability to move faster and operate longer in battle. Former Navy SEAL Chris Heben says the suit can make commandos even better. It is going to take a super soldier, a SEAL, a Green Beret, a Delta Force guy, and push him into a stratospheric level. Uh, what people don't realize is all these technologies exist already, but they exist separately. So they're taking them all and they're putting them together and they're adding some pretty cool things like liquid armor that becomes hardened uh, on a, on, in a millisecond. There are plenty of ideas. Imagery from drones or satellites overhead right into the helmet visual display. Boots that generate electricity with every step a soldier takes and flexible head to toe protection so troops can move closer to the enemy. If they can work out the bugs and, and, and get it to where it's functional. And it, it's going to allow, it's going to take a group of guys that are already extremely high functioning on the battlefield and make them completely unstoppable. McRaven wants the first version of an Iron Man suit within a year. For Out Front, Barbara Starr, The Pentagon.